Hello everyone once again welcome back to How To Hack. This is a continues video of DVWA SQL Injection. In the previous video we discussed about SQL Injection in low security, now we will discuss it in medium security. Here we can see a drop down list which have numbers. We can select any numbers in the list, but we cannot enter any commands like we have done in previous session. Now we are going to use this union command for displaying the table name from the database. Right click and inspect the page now find the HTML code for drop down list. See the command I enter in the inspect window. Once properly entering the command press submit. If you are not getting output make sure you enter the command properly. You can see after command executed all table name has been displayed. Now we can try high level security in SQL injection. Here we have a link for change the user ID. Just click on the link this will open up an option for entering the user ID. Here we are going to use a command to combine table name and column. You can see this command got executed so we can update this command for getting more values from database. Here I am going to combine name username and password to a single column. You can see password is displayed as hash. To break the hash. At first we have to identify which hashing algorithm is used to encrypt the password. Here I found an website to identify the hash. It was MD5 hashing and the website have decrypted the password, it was password itself. We can confirm it by trying another user's hash, here I am using Gordon's hash. Again the website identified it as abquan23. We can do one thing let's try to log into Gordon's account using the credential. Finally we log into Gordon's account. For more cybersecurity videos you can subscribe my channel.